to our episode of Super Action Bros. I'm Chris. I'm Christopher. And on today's episode, we are finally taking a look at the official trailer for the new Disney Plus original film, Disenchanted. Yes. So this is the long-awaited sequel. Uh, everybody's been wanting and asking for for so long now. I don't know why. Uh, it comes out Thanksgiving week. Um, the basic... Okay, so basically... This is what really, I know Amy Adams was relevant before the yeah. first film, but this is what really made her known. Yeah, he was the first Enchanted more. film. So for those who don't know, the first film was basically somebody from a happily ever after Disney style world winds up in the real world and um, has tries to go back, try to find a way to go back, meets uh, uh, Dr. Sexy Steamboat Guy. Uh, Steamboat Guy? What the fuck? <laughs> Dr. McSteamy and like, Eventually, it turns out her true love is him, and uh, James Marsden's character, who's the prince in this, yeah. winds up with his his original fiance yeah, exactly. in their world. So. so now we are set ten years later, and she's now starting to wonder if that spark is still gone. That happily ever after. Yeah, the type of the type of the, the typical. Um, is the happily ever after still alive? Is that yeah. you know? Is it true? You know. So of course you have Amy Adams, James Marsden, and all Patrick, them coming back. Doctor Jones returning, but you have coming to the cast Adia Menzel because yeah, no shit. Yeah. Uh, Evan Nicole Brown, Maya Rudolph's in as well, Oscar Nunez, and a grown-up oh, version true. of Patrick Dempsey's daughter from the first yeah. one. So. Because I, I know a few people that are excited for this, and because they've been asking for it as well. I never wanted a sequel, honestly. It's if we same, ever it's, got it's, one, to be honest, it's the same with Hocus Pocus too. It's like I thought the first I one was have, good, but I was like, but I'm like, I, I haven't uh, watched the second one yet. But it's one of those things where it's like, why? Um, but again, this is, I guess it's for the it's for the fans. That's what it is. That's what they made it for, and that's I think that's what they did here. Hopefully, the story is good enough to be like, hey. We did think about the fans, but we still wanted to give a good story, you know. So let's just dive into this for the official trailer for Disenchanted. 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 So here we go. <laughs> it's a Looks better than Hocus Pocus too. Yeah, it does. Uh, it does. It does a lot better. There's a more. What I like is here. There's there's more story that you could work with here. So basically, yeah, she like I said before, the premise is that yeah, she's not feeling that spark anymore. So she like inadvertently, ever, ever after, she after inadvertently after. turns our world into literally live action Disney. Musical. Yeah, it starts to leak out, and in, at the same time, it's slowly corrupting her because you see her kind of like that evil laugh a little bit, or like because you know, yeah, because in this story, she's technically the step evil, the wicked stepmother. stepmother. She's, she's turning into the wicked stepmother. stepmother. So that's why 
why it's like that's why you hear uh, his daughter going stepmother you know but stepmother he is locking her away pretty much like classic Cinderella story I did look, look it's a landfill a landfill with possibilities <laughs> I met I like that. for no for Adina Menzel though um, because that's not the same actress from the first one because remember he ended up with a, a different actress that's what it was I'll double check that yeah no it is though that's what it is because I'm like I, rem I, I, I definitely remember that it, was, it wasn't the same actress it was a different actress mm -hmm. uh, but that big cast attached to this as well I love I love uh, Yvette Nicole Brown she's such a darling oh, she is no she's going to in this so wicked <laughs> so weird and it looks like we do get glimpses at we're going to see also the animated world their animated world as Yo, well as well we're again it looks like it's leaking into our world that's why it said that's what i'm saying it's all coming out as well pretty much you know yeah. but just like that's what i said if you put this movie and this movie together this movie and hocus pocus 2 you ask me which one do you want to watch it's this one no she played the dm so play i guess it's been a while for me i'm I sorry can't, no it's you know no you know what it is this Remember, was it was before Frozen. Frozen, this is before. So this was no, not even that. This was before Frozen, before Glee was ever a big thing as well. You know, so this that's that's all it was. So I was that was my fault, pretty much. My mistake. Now I'm definitely looking forward to the film because now I know who she is. Exactly, you know. But um, yeah, I, I'm more excited to this than uh, how I was excited when you know when when they showed you know for Hocus Pocus two. To be honest, yeah, you know, Hocus one, Pocus two feels like they did it off of nostalgia reasons. Here they're doing. It, like it actually that, feels like nostalgia they, they actually have a story they want to work with and continue it and there we go and yeah the basis is what happens <laughs> years later when you don't feel that happily ever after you know, much anymore. exactly you know that's what that's what it is but I'm excited honestly for this one I'm actually more anticipated to watch this one than I am to Hocus Pocus 2 because like I said it's probably a while to watch Hocus Pocus 2 at some point who knows yeah so looks yeah I look surprisingly good for a straight to Disney plus original sequel film yeah it does more production value too that's a mouthful but uh other than that if you're new to the channel you can hit the like button if you want to talk to us more about stuff like this comment down below if you want to share us around share it around and if you like us just a little bit more than anybody else when it comes to realizing fuck james marston was in a sonic movie now he's playing the, uh, the prince charming again and weird stuff disney plus filled stuff remember it, when you first were introduced to him it was that he played cyclops and we didn't know who the fuck this guy was at the time remember hit the subscribe button down below and also hit that bell icon as well it was so very true but what do you guys think of this you know are you guys you know for fans of the first enchanted film what are you guys excited for this you know are you guys pumped to see this film you know make a return and does it look like the story's gonna be just a strong and are you one of those pretty much who agree with us where it feels like if you had a choice between hocus pocus 2 and and this film you would rather choose this film overall i mean Everybody has their opinions. Everybody has their, you know, thoughts and stuff like that. You know, again, I still haven't seen Hocus Pocus 2, so I can't really say much about it. But just um, we're going off a of trailer wise of what we saw from the trailer to this trailer yeah, as well. But I mean, let us know what you guys thoughts are on this. Are you guys excited? Are you guys pumped to see these characters return and see this, you know, this grand new adventure of what she's going to be diving into? I mean, let us know in the comments down below. But don't just thought of our reaction overall. But most importantly, we thank you for watching. Watching. So until next time, I'm Kristen. I'm Christopher. And this has been a very not so enchanted Phil episode of SRB. See ya. Later. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you want to check out any of our previous reactions, as well as one of our other SRB shows, check out one of the playlists down below. And if you want to check us out in the social universe, you can find us on Twitter and start us at Super React Bros. As well as on Facebook at Super Reaction Bros.